Hello, you guys. How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing awesome. We're gonna get right into it, you guys. So, take what resonates with you. You know, your story. Don't try to make it feel if it's not for you, collective. Okay, we're gonna get right into it. See what's going on. We're gonna get some of these. Let's like, see what's going on. What's the message? Thank you guys for being here with me. You guys are awesome. I hope you guys have an amazing day, an amazing week, an amazing rest of the year. Y'all, this year don't went by so fast. It's almost over. It's almost over. Okay. Good luck is coming to you, collective, and love your life. Uh, you don't heal some type of wound. Your root chakra, that keeps on coming up. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because you're seeing through the veil here. Someone's trying to hide themselves. They're trying to cloak themselves. They're trying to disguise themselves as someone else. Something about the veil, too. Oh, oh Hollow's Eve. The, the full moon. Something about the full moon. What's going on? Yeah, some type of magic is backfiring here. Yeah, somebody done sick this obia out to you. That shit is backfiring. Somebody could be pregnant too as well. Somebody could have traveled to some Africans or shit. I'm hearing um Philly, Louisiana, Baltimore, Charlie Baltimore. Her hair was red. Charlie could be significant. Somebody could be trying to kidnap somebody. I don't know. Somebody traveled to a witch doctor to get some obia done. Yeah, somebody tried to take some type of action. Yeah, but something was recorded here. Somebody was, something was seen. Yeah, what somebody did. Somebody did this. Somebody could be six feet tall. Somebody think they're like a beast. Or you look at this person as if they are a beast. So somebody. So when the veil is thin, somebody going to try to release some type of beast on you in October. Something is ending, though, for this beast. It's been attached to you. Been tapping into your energy. Yeah, somebody trying to tap into your energy. You cleanse your energy and your space to this person, or you need to cleanse your energy and your space. Yeah, somebody settled for somebody because they were trying to stay cool. So now this person see you as the catalyst here. You're very motivated. You're motivating this person. So somebody trying to cause a quick change because you're very uh, motivating to others. Somebody don't like this. So they're trying to block you from tapping in or they're trying to tap into. Somebody want to tap in to get your knowledge is what I'm getting. Yeah, somebody could be watching you online. A karmic terror reader that's confused. Think they're divine here. So they're trying to do some type of magic on your platform or something. Yeah, trying to block you. Go find you something to do, please, and thank you with your karmic ass. Go heal. That's what somebody needs to do. Like, who got time? Who's that trying to tap in and block somebody? They're trying to tap in to get your knowledge. Because you're too damn knowledgeable for them. You know too much. Yeah, so somebody's trying to get on your path. They're trying to change something, change something swiftly. You see through the veil, they don't. You see more than them. Look, so this person's trying to tap in and steal some of your energy. This, this is a main female here. 
that was expecting to be like a leader or a, you know, an official person or something like that. Yeah. So this person was expected to steal your leadership position. So you are a leader. You've been held in high honor. You are a seer. You can see through the veil. This person trying to steal that gift from you so they can become official. This could even be a masculine that's trying to cloak themselves as a feminine. Take it how it resonates. Yeah, look, I'm telling you, they're concerned. They know you see them. Yeah, they has been exposed. Yeah. This is an older man that wants to be your main male. So they tap into your energy. They steal some of your light. Yeah, they invade your space. They're trying to mess with your stability. People got too much time on their hands. I'm hearing that sound. Time on my hands. Since you've been away, boy. Mm -mm -mm. I ain't got no place. No, 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 no. Do -do 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 -do. So somebody was expecting him to take some of that hot, fiery energy. They were trying to take some type of action. Yeah, because you got that higher self uh, activation here. Look, it's your energy. You got that higher knowledge and your energy is pure. So somebody was expecting to steal something. A Pisces cancel a Scorpio here. Yeah. This person could party a lot. Yeah, in autumn here, the harvest, full moon, somebody tried to connect to you. This is somebody you have a soul tied to. Yeah, somebody could be going through an awakening here, but they're going to get karma for being in that shadow side, for trying to keep you in your shadow side or pull you out, whatever they did in the dark. Yeah, they're going to get karma. Damn. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. They could be attracted to you too as well. Oh, honey. Like, find something to do. This is an ex-lover. This is somebody you got a soul tied soul contract with. This is a past life soulmate. They done turned karmic because they are attacking you. They've been stealing your energy instead of like trying to work with you or something. I'm here, chill out. Yeah, chill out, cuz. I don't know if they're grip or what. Chill out, cuz. Mr. Man, chill out. Yeah, clinging. On to their uh, south node here. Okay, so they could be messing with uh, a Leo, Aries, Sagittarius' energy. They feel guilty for trying to cause some type of nostalgia here. Because like I said, this is a past life soulmate or karmic or whatever you want to call them that was trying to control you and make you feel closed off. You, you closed off to this person because they're very controlling and manipulative. And whoever this is, they try to flex that muscles. They could be six feet or taller. They're very, very like, um, they're like a tyrant is what I'm getting. And this person is like hiding in the shadow. They could be stalking you, watching you, looking for you. Damn, I'm here. I'm going to find you and make you want me. Ready or not, here I come. You can't hide them. They gonna make you want them? What's going on with this masculine? Look. Make you want him. Damn. You can't run away. Yes, you can. <laughs> they regret doing this magic on you. Mm-hmm. And keeping you repressed here. Well, because now they want a partnership. They want to partner up. So tired. Like I said, they want to go through this transformation. They see you going through this transformation because somebody with this Pluto energy, that's that death energy. They most definitely trying to cause you a lot of endings. Somebody could even be trying to do some type of sex magic or they need it in the past and they regret doing that. 
Mm -hmm. They did that for stability and harmony, for things to flow for them. And the uh, I'm getting the third party, but you seeing clearly now. Somebody want a new beginning. Whoever this Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio is, they getting like guided to you. Are you getting signs about this person from your spirit guides, your ancestors? Mm. Somebody doing a lot of like uh, water magic too as well. Or somebody's in their emotions. They got to resonate. They doing too damn much though. Somebody Gemini. Gemini lovers energy. Loyal. You could have been loyal to this person. Communication. They stuck. These cards don't ever. Oh, man. Oh, uh, somebody cash out too as well. Um, they could be trying to get some cash out for you. Yeah, somebody stuck. Yeah, look. Bind. They trying to keep you stuck to them. Somebody's binding to a contract. Or they're trying to bind you to a contract. Collective. They got to resonate. But somebody's been most definitely spiritually stealing from you and like diverting your money is what I'm getting. They sending out a lot of somebody was sending out like a fake destiny for you or wanted you to believe in some type of fake destiny. Somebody somebody's hairline too. See, they ain't showing their hairline. These masks. Something about their hairline is what I'm getting. Somebody some storage. Mm-hmm. They could be sending out like Evil arrows of sickness, pain, suffering, like disease, misfortune, sorrow, hardship. Yeah, because you walked away from them or something. Yeah. Yeah, man. Somebody travel to get some type of support done or get something. So you would be scared or depressed. I don't know. Somebody wants you to be like mentally conflicted. They are sending like thorns to as well. Somebody wants you to be weak. They're doing money spells. Something about April. Something about five o'clock too as well. Five o'clock. Somebody could be. I'm happy I was drinking. I don't know. Clarify, Mason. Wait a minute. Ooh. Oh, wow. You got death. Something's ending for this Mason. Whatever they were desiring here, or even them trying to persevere. Yeah, because they, they it's, it's too hard for them to try to steal something from you or end something for you. Somebody's conflicted here. They want you to be conflicted. They want you to be poor, assed out, whoever the stubborn person is that's in the dark. They want you to be suffering in the dark. They're trying to give you nightmares and shit. All oh, that shit is over. They try to do death spells. Somebody try to do a, oh. Uh, somebody did graveyard magic. Yeah, and they promised they would get some type of victory and success off of Doing these death spells on you or whatever. You or this man, so take it how it resonates. What's this death? And this man's gonna. Look, somebody did a death curse. You can relax. It's the ending to this spirit spouse. This person been blocking you for a long time. Yeah, been having you feeling like a castaway, assed out. This person, like I said, they have been attacking you spiritually. They have been connected to you. Even having like sex with you and everything in the spiritual realm. Blocking you from marriage. And all that. This person was codependent on your energy. Yeah, that's how they got luck and fortune. Like I said, they wanted you to have misfortune. Like I said, this person got a big ass ego. Yeah, this person wanted you to be lonely, isolated by yourself. And this person was real prideful here. Whoever this is, this is a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. 
Something about 40. 79 could be significant. 40. I mean, somebody say, I'm, I'm only 40 years old. Somebody's being blocked or they can't do something or something is ending. Wait a minute, why am I hearing 40? So there's a false person here that was saving to get some type of wealth and now they apologize for trying to steal something is what I'm getting. Somebody that's 40 years old is working with this person too. Or this mask could be 40. Take it how it resonates. But they did a death spell on you. And that shit is backfiring. Yeah, somebody could be 40. 40. Hey, I think. Is it 40? Oh. Gang related? Something like that. Or it could be that age. Take it how it resonates. Wait a minute. Oh, okay. Clarify, oh, chemistry. Oh. Your passion to love on yourself, your self-esteem, your self-worth. Yeah, somebody trying to block that. <clears throat> Stagmentation for you is what they said. Nope, they're going to break that. Somebody trying to break you. Yeah, man. They were trying to break you from loving on yourself. Yeah, they want you to feel lost. Somebody's familiar is a dog. Yeah, look, somebody wants you to have inner conflict here. Somebody don't want you to be passionate about yourself. Somebody don't want somebody feel like you just surprised or you're boastful because you love on yourself. You got good self-esteem. You you too damn confident. You too damn confident. They won't take your crown off. Yeah. You sending your emperor energy, your boss energy. They don't like this shit. Somebody wants you to be a fucking peon, a peasant. They want you to be a victim. They worked hard for you to be a victim, and you're not. You're nobody's victim. Yeah, what's this regret here? What's this regret? Somebody regret playing mind games, playing with your imagination. They should have took some type of advice. But somebody was coached to do this here. Somebody regret um, getting coached or getting advice from somebody to play mind games with you. Yeah, but this person was stubborn. They didn't want to listen. They wanted victory and success, and they did the magic anyway. Yeah. This is somebody who, uh, somebody from your childhood is what I'm getting. Or you got a child with this person. Take it how it resonates. Yeah, they getting karma. Now they're trying to be logical. Somebody's mad because you balanced out your spirituality and practicality. Somebody's mad. You're the equalizer is what I'm getting, and they mad. Somebody's mad. Ooh, they mad. Mm. They ready to give up. Somebody saying, I'm tired. I'm tired. Alchemy. You need one for alchemy, please. Alchemy. Yeah, somebody spirit guys told them, don't do this magic. Look, don't do this magic. Don't do it. They apologize. Look, somebody tried to cause a time moment to your blessings. You, your well-being, your fulfillment. Just you being balanced. You being spiritual or whatever. Somebody didn't like this shit. Like I said, you balanced your spirituality, practicality. You found yourself or whatever. Somebody didn't like that. Now they want to apologize. They feel guilty. They want your forgiveness here for being fake, being a shapeshifter, being a false person. Even like you got evidence of this person trying to plant some type of seeds in your dream state is what I'm getting. You got evidence of this of somebody even just working real hard here to try to uh, get your vitality. But somebody see that you're very talented here yeah, and it's deeply rooted. Somebody, most definitely, you got some type of evidence about somebody getting a professional doing some roots on you too as well. Yeah, because you see their ass. You see through the veil. Most definitely. Somebody apologize here. Yeah. yeah, somebody took a big risk here, yeah, but you survived all this bullshit. Yeah, somebody took a vow here. Yeah, they were hoping and wishing and praying that this magic worked. Look. 
They were praying here. They were ready to try to keep you in isolation or make you be an introvert here. Yeah, but they seen online that you loving on yourself. You healed yourself. So somebody's watching you. Mm -hmm. So they try to cause some type of disturbance here. So they done collabed and teamed up with your friends or their friends or whatever because they thought it was a good idea. They thought they were going to gain something off of a sweetheart here. Yeah, somebody's trying to put you in an illusion that you need help from them. You don't need no damn help from them. Yeah, they want to try to bribe you and shit because you got all the knowledge, the information. You've been trying for this. You know, whatever. Somebody's going to live and learn about trying to control somebody's wealth and keep them in isolation. Yeah. And cause blockages here. Yeah, you learned about all these people doing this shit. Yeah, so they getting karma. They're going to get karma. They, they want the attention, they gonna get it. You hear me? Yeah, somebody feels inadequate here because you are a fortune teller. Yeah, somebody was desiring to do magic on you. Yeah. Keep doing rituals and ceremonies on you. Yeah, because somebody was planning to cause you some type of accident. And they would get some type of fortune. But you can relax, collect. If you're gonna get victory and success, and they just gonna be angry for whatever they were planning to do. Yeah, they worked hard, too. I work real hard. What did it say? Yeah, somebody stressed out because somebody's ill. Somebody, somebody, whoever this third wheel is, they travel. Three people travel here at night to try to get, cause you some type of nightmare or sickness or something. At night, I'm telling you, they, they want you to be weak. They want you to have lack of sleep. Like I said, they shoot them arrows at night trying to make you have nightmares and shit. And they think it's funny. Kiki, ha ha. Yeah. They think it's funny. But yeah, I'm going to end it right there, you guys. Yeah. Pay attention to who around you because these people. What came out? Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Pay attention, y'all. Yeah, because they hate us. They've been in your dreams. They pay attention to your dreams. Yeah, look, the karmics are making bad decisions here. They ain't doing nothing but accumulating karmic debt here. Yeah. Let's see. What's going on? Somebody was paid to commit a crime. Yeah, like I said, somebody paid somebody in the next week or two. What's going on? Halloween. So, in the next week or two, yeah, the new moon and the full moon. Somebody pay somebody to do something on the new moon or the full moon. Yeah, Halloween. When the veil is thin, somebody think they finna... Okay. Somebody gonna meet that maker. They better quit playing. Look, going broke. They gonna be in poverty. I'm telling you, they better quit playing. This weekend. Oh, this... this Oh, it's going down this month. Somebody don't pay child support. Somebody prosperity and abundance here. Your money good collective. Somebody going broke. Somebody doing money spells on you so you could go broke. This person don't want to pay child support or they trying to block your child support. They can't resonate. Or somebody. Honey. Something is ending completely in the next week or two for somebody. And it's going up for you. You hear me? That's all I got to say. Yeah, because something is backfiring most definitely. Whoever they pay, yeah, whoever the person is who keep doing magic on you, they ass finna die. Yeah, because that shit's finna backfire. It's gonna backfire. Whoever, it's an older gentleman, too. Yeah. Yeah, banish the magician with fire sending uh, burning sensation and pain. Yeah, so they... Mm, okay. Banish the magician with fire, sending burning sensations and pain. So yeah, some something, something like that. Yeah, something like that. Collective. I'm gonna end it right there, y'all. I'm gonna leave it like.